वेलकम टू द नॉलेज पैराडाइज के यूट्यूब चैनल हैव यू एवर वंडर दैट हाउ टू क्रिएट अ चेयर इन सॉलिड वर्क सो लेट्स स्टार्ट First of all select this file option then go to this new tab here you have to select this part option and now press this okay button so in order to create a chair firstly you have to select this top plane select it go to this sketch mode it will automatically normalize it now you have to select this center rectangle now select this origin and just draw a rectangle now press this okay button now i am going to use the technique of small dimension just click over it select this line and make it as 15 inches Now press this okay button. Similarly, press this one. And again, I am going to use this small dimension option. So select this, press this line, and here make it 13 inches. Now press this okay button. Similarly, press this. Now I am going to use a technique of fillet. Here you can see the sketch fillet option. So select it. Now here select this line. and then select this line so here it is showing a very small curve between these two lines so here just enhance it little bit i think 1.5 inch will be perfect this now similarly select this line and this line similarly select this line and this line and also select this line and this line now press this okay button now use this extruded boss base command so select it and here 2 inches now press this okay button now select this bottom surface and then go to this sketch mode and normalize it now i am going to use another technique just move here and select this circle option and now just move your cursor over this arc or this curve it will automatically show its center here so select it and draw a circle from this this or region to this arc now press this okay button similarly again select this circle option and draw another circle here similarly press this okay button now again select this circle option similarly you have to select this arc in order to find this origin and draw a circle similarly press this okay button now again select this circle option and select this origin and draw another circle here now press this okay button now again i am going to use extruded boss base command so firstly select this features tab and then go to this extruded boss base command i think 12 inch will be perfect now press this okay button now again select this top surface and go to this sketch mode and normalize it now i am going to use another technique select this line and draw a line here from this point to this point now here you have to select this center point arc now move your cursor over this arc which we have already created and find this origin and draw an arc from this point to at least here just imagine that you are creating an arc and just create it here Now press this okay button. Now again I am going to use another technique here. So just select this line here and click on this point and draw a horizontal line. Now again select the center point arc and draw and find the origin of this arc and from this origin you have to draw an arc from this point to this point which lies on this line. Now press this okay button. Now use this trim entities option in order to remove this line and similarly remove this line as well. So press this okay button now. Now you have to again select this line option and just draw a line from this point and this line must be vertical. Now use this smart dimension technique and dimension this line at least 0.7 inches. Now press this okay button. Now press this button here. Now I am going to create another line here. Just select it and from this point and draw an hor a horizontal line here to this point. 
and now I'm going to use stream entities option and now just remove this line we don't need it press this ok button here now use another technique of this spline option just select it and now select this line and now select this line and now just rotate it little bit click again here and now just click over this spline again so we have created a spline here now again select this spline option and similarly select this point and then click on this point and then thirdly you have to click on this line again and then you have to click on this spline option now I am going to use the technique of trim entities just select it and move your cursor zoom in and you have to delete this curve here so move your cursor over this curve similarly you have to again zoom out then again zoom in and move this curve as well now press this ok button now I am going to use this extruded boss space command so go to this feature tab and then click on this extruded boss space command 17 inches will be perfect yes this is perfect press this ok button by using your creative mind you can further enhance it but it totally depends on you for example I am going to uh, select this surface then go to this sketch mode and here I am going to normalize it so for example we can say that any company created it and uh, any brand created it and uh, uh, that brand has a special logo it is just a supposition so select this line from here and then select this point and just draw a vertical line to this point just use this rectangle here but this time I'm going to use the center rectangle now select this the center of this line and just create a rectangle press this ok button now again select this circle here draw a circle according to your own desires of any dimension but here I'm going to just make it as a position now press this ok button now again select the stream entities option now just remove all those additional lines from here like shown here just move all of them just move all of them now press this ok button here now use this extruded cut command so just select this through all option here and press this ok button now I am going to uh, change its appearance so firstly you have to select this phase and then go to this drop down select this phase 1 option now uh, select all these surfaces or faces uh, and make sure that you didn't miss anyone just select all these faces from here similarly select this face these uh, inner faces as well make sure that you have selected all these surfaces and similarly select this inner surface of this circle now in the appearance option here you will find in this appearance tab you will find organic tab and in the organic tab you will find this wood option and in this wood option here you will find a wall net option and in the wall net option here you will find this polished walnut and green I think it is perfect yes I have missed this face I think click on this face as well and also this face now press this ok button here so we have successfully changed the appearance of this chair as well I have missed these surfaces as well so again select this surface and go to this drop down select phase 1 option and also select these bottom surfaces of of the legs of the chair similarly go to this appearance option and in the wooden option here you will find this walnut option and just select this polished walnut and grain option now press this ok button so here you can see that we have successfully created a whole chair by using simple commands of SOLIDWORKS. Thank you very much for watching the video. Please like, share and comment. Kindly subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for further notifications.